Minister of Housing and Water Colin Crowell on Monday visited the construction site of 100 low- and moderate-income homes at Great Diamond, East Bank de Marara. Suriname's Visionary Builders and Services is erecting 50 low-income units with modern materials that accelerate construction. Each 600-square-foot unit will have two bedrooms, a washroom, and a living room with an estimated cost of $5.5 million. This type of house is different. As you can see, uh, the type of wall that is being used, in fact, they, they, they're using the metal sheet and then plastering it with um, concrete. Uh, so we expect the first 26 houses to com be completed by the end of this month. You see, this it's already framed here, so they're actually doing the internal. Similarly, 50 moderate-income homes are also being built utilizing blocks made only of recycled plastic. The units, being built by South Atlantic, measure 600 square feet and are priced at $5.9 million each. While the size of the house is uh, similarly 600 square feet, they're different, the type of materials being used, that is why the price is a little more than the regular blue income that we normally have between 5.2 to 5.5. Minister Kroll stated that the individuals who have been pre-qualified for the homes are eagerly awaiting their completion. The construction of these low- and moderate-income homes is a significant move towards addressing the housing needs in Guyana. It is also part of the government's new strategy to prioritize building homes rather than allocating house lots.